Matt here again, Home Farm Ideas, and I'm gonna give you guys another update on my uh, aquaponic potatoes. Uh, the last time I did a video, um, I believe it was uh, April 15th, and today is the 23rd. So, let's have a look. Okay, it's getting a little crazy now. If you watch the last video right here in the card section, you'll see that uh, the potatoes are coming along really good. Um, they've grown probably double since the last video I did. And the leaves are looking pretty good, although I am seeing one issue. Um, but my iron and everything that I add is supposed to be tomorrow, okay? So I keep it on a schedule. And so they might be showing signs of deficiency because they're getting right around the time where um, they need nutrients. So with that said, um, I'm going to show you everything that I'm noticing on these plants. Um, so right off the bat, I mean, their growth has just been really good. I mean, they're nice and tall now. And I would like to see them a little more bushy. Um, but I think it's because they're really starting to take off upward, so they're not really bushing out too much. Um, so we'll see. Uh oh, I'm seeing something right now that might not be good. That, that I don't think is good. I can't remember the names of these things. Uh, if you guys know, let me know in the comment section below. But I think those are bad. Oh, man, I can't remember what they're called because I haven't dealt with them in years. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and let's look at the plant here. So, as you can see, most of the leaves, they look really good. I don't see any yellowing in the leaves that much. Um, usually when uh, you start getting a problem with chlorosis, um, usually it'll start in, the, in between the leaves if you're having like an iron deficiency. And I am seeing a tiny bit of yellowing, but nothing crazy. And like I said, I'm supposed to be dosing this up tomorrow. Um, so I might just do it today. Now the newer growth, the newer growth is looking okay. Yep, see, there's another one of them bugs right there. So this might be the cause of the uh, other issue that I'm noticing. Um, anyway, let's let's stick to the plan here. So you can see there's flowers coming in there. Okay, so we're gonna start getting flowers, which means potatoes, usually. Okay. Um, so as we go through this plant here and we look around, you can start to see little bits of chlorosis. And you notice it's, well, it's kind of in between the leaves. Yeah, if you guys know what this is, let me know in the comment section below, please. Um, I am getting this all around the plant too. Let me see if I can get this out of the shade. Okay, so I'm starting to get this all around. Not too many bugs eating on the plant so far that I've noticed, but this is starting to spread. So if I don't know what this is and deal with it right away, it could decimate the plant. Because um, when things go wrong, they can go wrong really quickly. Uh, all the new growth looks pretty good. <clears throat> I would like to see it more bushy, like I said. Um, but overall, it's doing okay. Uh, let's see here. Right here, here's some more. See that? Uh, inside, not too bad. I mean, it is kind of bushy, but I would much rather have it a lot more bushy. Okay. Uh, good news on the plants in the back, they have officially caught up. So that's the top there. And then this is the other one. So they're getting plenty of sun. Um, they're just lagging just a little behind. So, <clears throat> so yeah, so far so good. I have not made that adjustment to the standpipe yet to shorten the uh, water level. Uh, I think I might let it go. I think I might just let it go this year and then try it out next year because I don't want to change things in the middle of all this, you know what I mean? So anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below on what those bugs are that I showed you. And then also uh, what kind of little bits of chlorosis are on my leaves. Um, you know, this bug here. 
see if I can get it to focus, there we go. And then this chlorosis that's on the leaves. So it's not on a lot of them yet, but it's it's around the plant and you know, I gotta take care of it. So I might just uh, be adding my iron today along with my um, kelp meal powder and a few other things. So anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Uh, I read all of your comments and I always uh, comment back and so I want to hear from you guys on this. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, obviously put them down there. And um, if you like the video, obviously give it a thumbs up and hit that bell icon so you get all my video updates on these potatoes because uh, I'm going to be posting uh, regularly on these until I harvest. So, all right. Like always, you guys, God bless you and peace.